my laboratory in general is engaged in taking the common constituents of air such as dinitrogen, carbon dioxide and oxygen and converting them to useful chemicals uh, that can be later upgraded to fuels, fertilizers or other chemicals that are relevant for the pharmaceutical and uh, chemical industry. The goal of this research is to find innovative catalytic solutions that work at lower overpotentials that are more efficient and more selective. Now one part that we are trying to do is use earth abundant metals. Earth abundant metals are metals that can be found all around us such as iron, manganese, cobalt and these are different than the typical transition metals that have been used in the chemical industry such as platinum, rhodium and ruthenium. The advantage is, is that they are much cheaper, they are more environmental friendly and they are relatively available so they are much more abundant around than all the other precious metals. There is a lot of interest in now in fuel cell technology where these catalysts can be integrated to. So fuel cells are important components now in battery uh, technologies, but they're also important, for instance, for converting sunlight into chemical energy. We're providing the catalysts that are cheap to operate, long lasting and very active. And in such a way, the fuel cell will operate at a higher efficiency with a higher output Besides that, by using the earth abundant metals, the production cost of these fuel cells can be lowered and therefore they are much more beneficial. Within the Technion, the GTAP is a unique program that brings different researchers from different disciplines together. So for instance, by having joint meetings, we can discuss new scientific ideas, listen to new developments in the field, and therefore the research ideas are really collaborative, and therefore we can benefit from each other's expertise in order to facilitate our research. Besides that, the facilities that the GTAP provides sometimes are too large to be housed in a single individual lab. Therefore, having an umbrella environment that provides these types of techniques can be extremely beneficial to accomplish the research.